So are you able to view my screen? Uh, which contains the code? Yeah, yes, look. So uh, every component uh, just consists of an uh, 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 will deep uh, will drive will drive deeper into component data just uh, just to show the uh, another the MSV framework uh, let, let's show the every component consists of you can see that in the have it contains the have dot have component of HTML which is going to work on the view layer and the have component of series which is going to uh, work on uh, the uh, styling part of it and the uh, uh, specter TS file which used to do a unit testing of this file and uh, component of file which used to uh, do the internal or it used to talk with service layer it used to uh, talk with service layer to get the uh, data and uh, massage the data as per you want so uh, so uh, so angular this is a very good uh, uh, msd uh, uh, pattern so it will help us to uh, for example if the uh, service is changed uh, later so we can directly go to the uh, service layer and change it instead of uh, uh, changing the entire thing so we can change our particular that's one of the uh, one of the major advantages of angular so uh, history of angular angular uh, which is usually down to the google so it is uh, initially called as an angular j angular uh, angular j uh, has angular j has an, uh, Angular JS and Angular uh, 2.0, uh, which is uh, different from uh, so Angular JS has a different uh, uh, different rule to uh, build the application. Uh, similarly, Angular has an uh, uh, which is different from the Angular JS. So uh, in September 2016, the Angular 2.0 was released. Uh, initial, uh, then uh, the major version of Angular. The later uh, they come to. Uh, Thing like we should call uh, Angular 2 from 2 Angular. So that is a two different thing now. Angular J and Angular. Uh, Angular J is something different from Angular. So uh, these are the uh, the core concept of Angular. So we will look uh, one by one. So uh, component uh, uh, component uh, yeah in Angular everything is a uh, uh, component. For example, so uh, app component. Uh, uh, so in the index.html file, uh, I'll, I'll show up one. So everything is a component. Uh, uh, so uh, in the setup application, uh, sorry, in the, in the whenever we make uh, the request to uh, slash, so it will press the uh, uh, every component is the uh, uh, selector. Uh, we will uh, use, uh, so a component consists of uh, HTML template. Uh, so uh, HTML template which is to uh, 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 how the uh, HTML view, view layer should be. So let me uh, 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 show, uh, go through the code. Are you able to uh, see my screen now? Show code screen? Screen now. Yeah. So uh, you can see that. Uh, so Angular, uh, which con uh, consists of everything, is an uh, component. So you can see that uh, in, uh, Angular contains the only one index.html file. So in the in the index.html file, we will specify half by one root. So uh, uh, so half by one root, we will uh, look for the app uh, uh, specify uh, uh, selector. So let's go to the app component. So uh, in this uh, in the app component, uh, so every component should be included uh, uh, in the app model or just the app model dot ts. So app co app component is the de uh, default one which is provided by Angular. So from there, application starts moving. So in the index.html file, we are uh, given the app by one. So uh, it will look for uh, app component dot ts. So in the app model dot ts, uh, whenever we we start creating the one more new component that that should be imported here. Uh, same way the uh, model works. So Module will be put here, and the same as the uh, uh, module and component also. So uh, modules I will look on data. So we concentrate first on uh, components. So uh, every component which consists of uh, uh, app component, uh, component HTML file, so uh, uh, CSS file and uh, uh, test file which is used to do a uh, unit test of the thing, and on TS file. Uh, TS file uh, which is used to do the uh, business logic of the uh, your component uh, to get the data. Uh, uh, from the service and uh, uh, iterate the data and in the form of your This is component, uh, let's uh, property bank. So, uh, the, the 
property binding one of the key feature of the uh, mdc framework is how we bind the uh, property to one uh, particular uh, html file for example so we uh, in jquery we, uh, we can uh, give a for dynamic data, we can uh, do uh, do the property binding using uh, document uh, in the JavaScript document or get element by ID, or in the uh, jQuery uh, uh, query selector. In the query selector, we can do it. So, uh, Angular gives a uh, four type of a pro property binding, uh, which help us to uh, uh, pass the uh, data from view to property. So, uh, let let's see as uh, let's see this. One. So uh, string integration. So uh, the string integration uh, which is the uh, 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 in the string int integration, the syntax will be uh, in the double uh, double braces the code. So the, the property which we defined. Uh, the property which we defined uh, in the uh, common dot file. So you can specify them using. The property which we define in the uh, component field, we can uh, specify them using uh, in the double quotes. So this uh, 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 string integration is one way data binding, but the, uh, uh, it can it can be uh, uh, set from component to uh, view. So uh, property binding, the property binding also is similar to uh, uh, string integration. So instead of uh, 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 Double quote, double quote gives the, uh, uh, it is the uh, at uh, square bracket. So uh, the property which we defined in the uh, this one, so we can access then the uh, element uh, HTML element using the source uh, like that. So uh, both property binding and uh, uh, single integration is the same thing. So what is the major difference between that? So For, uh, for example, uh, uh, take, an, uh, take an example. So, uh, uh, if, if you have the uh, property which, uh, which uh, in the button class, which, uh, you have a uh, current, uh, uh, current value which is default now or false. So, when, when you try to change it later to uh, uh, false, so uh, in the uh, in the uh, property binding it will change. But uh, if, if you use the uh, string integration, it won't. So, uh, back to use string interesting uh, integration. Uh, whenever whenever you deal with, uh, de uh, dealing with the non-string integration, so uh, whenever uh, we are uh, dealing with non-string uh, expression like uh, 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 binding the property uh, to a uh, disabled class like that, so you have to, you have to go with uh, property binding. So uh, event binding, uh, event binding. Uh, uh, I hope uh, everyone is working on the uh, jQuery uh, JavaScript PT event like that. So whenever the clicker thing happen, uh, get the data from the element and send to common to the event binder. So you can see that uh, button clicks on uh, this method is common in the uh, 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 this, uh, uh, in this component or PS file. So we have a this method. So uh, the property will be uh, initially the property will be the uh, learning statistic integration. So later it will be changed to uh, learning event uh, So uh, two way data binding, uh, two way data binding, uh, which <coughs> which used both of uh, we, we use, uh, use both of uh, both uh, property and event binding. So uh, it will be uh, used in most area of user when interact with the uh, form elements. For example, user try to uh, submit the data, want to fetch uh, the data, split it and keep the display. Yeah? So this kind of uh, proposed uh, two way binding is supposed to. So uh, two way binding, you can see that uh, two way binding use the ng model. So uh, ng model uh, which is not part of uh, Angular code uh, library. So we have uh, the, uh, we, we have to import the uh, form modules uh, uh, in the app model dot as well. So that we can use the ng, uh, uh, we can implement the two way uh, two way data binding. So how to So uh, you can see that uh, the form model we have to 
啊，所以啊，有跟那个谁啊，念书的，所以也是。So as per the previous talk, uh, we talk about the routing. Uh, so I can also use the uh, routing to uh, uh, fetch data from uh, 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 it, 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 the angular processing. The since the angular processing uh, interface application it uses the routing to uh, 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 get the uh, one view to another view. As per uh, user clicks on or uh, user types the URL from the uh, in the uh, browser. So uh, to, uh, to, uh, to include the uh, router, we have to import the uh, Routing router module, uh, router module in the uh, app app module dot ds file. So then the uh, router module has to be import and it has to be declared uh, and So, uh, router angular application is the one uh, as the one single instance of router. Application. So, uh, same uh, same for as per we discuss uh, angular uh, angular is a single page application. So, it has the one single turn instance of uh, router service. So, uh, whenever the browser you want to change, uh, it will look for a uh, corresponding route. For example, uh, we change to home to app uh, services. Uh, sorry, home to about uh, about. So, it will look for a uh, selector. Uh, 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 which we are uh, defined in the uh, route mode uh, route mode dot so let us discuss that. So you can see that uh, in the app route module dot um, module dot ts. So uh, we have to specify uh, 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 the path uh, which has to be. Uh, for example, if it is a slash, it, is, it should be uh, fetching the home component. So the component should be imported over there. If it is about, uh, it should be uh, fetch the about component. Uh, if it is contacting, it should fetch the contact component. Like this. Uh, it Yeah, uh, that's it from uh, my side. So I will share the uh, documentation which I used to uh, follow uh, follow to, uh, for, for this uh, uh, session. So uh, in the upcoming uh, session, we can have the deep dive session of which uh, uh, in which we we'll, uh, talk uh, more on the service layer and uh, how to uh, work on the HTTP client and observe all the Thank you for joining. Ah, thank you, thank you, Rajesh. Hi, Lokesh. Yes. Ah, this is Gokul. Okay. Yeah, uh, Lokesh, uh, I'm just curious to know from when uh, Angular is using uh, decorators? From the Angular. Uh, and let's do uh, so we use to separate the uh, modifications. Okay, okay, but, uh, okay. Uh, I, I also not, uh, noticed that uh, in your component files there, are, there is also a cons controller and also an MG on in it. Uh, so, what is the difference between these two groups? I guess the controller, uh, sorry, constructs are used to run uh, the initial installation part. Yes, so yes, like uh, uh, on it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, you are uh, almost correct. Uh, the constructor which, which is used to uh, work on the initial part, uh, the ng on, on in it, uh, while loading the DOM, uh, it will be, uh, uh, the, the process will be engineered to work on the while uh, loading the DOM. So if, if uh, the entire uh, component, uh, component elements are entered, the ng on it will be on, yeah. in it will be called, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Okay.